Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to edit the checkout page in Wix in 2023. So of course, the checkout page is a crucial part for your website's e-commerce functionality. And Wix provides you with the tool to customize this according to your preferences. And this video will guide you through the steps or the process of editing the ch checkout page in Wix. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into it, and let's get started. Before we start with this video, Make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So first, let's start by opening whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open this browser, make sure to go to this URL section and type wix.com and hit the enter button. Of course, that will take you directly to the home screen or main screen of Wix website. If you have an account, uh, you'll not find yourself here, of course. Uh, if it's your first time, you'll find yourself on the home screen. If you have an account, make sure to go and log into your account by clicking on Login into your account. And if you don't have an account, click on Get Started and follow the prompt to uh, log or to create your account. Of course, you can use the free plan first of all of Wix websites, and you can even go and upgrade your plan if you want to. If you click here, you'll be able to see all the plans that you want, or and you can I even mean, upgrade any site that you want with it. So for us, of course, we'll have to go and access the, to ch the checkout page settings. So as an example, I'm just going to uh, any size of those, as an example, this one. And I'm just going to try get into the editor of Wix website. So let's just wait for the page until it loads or the website until it loads. It should not take a lot of time. And of course, to, uh, once we log in into it, of course, we'll have to go and edit the website on and onto it. As you can see, I'm just going to go into this design of your website and click on edit site. That will take me into the editor site of Wix website directly. And from there, I'll be able to access the, my website and I will be able to edit anything on it. So of course, if you want to edit your checkout page, you'll need to access its settings and you will have to click on the checkout page on your website to select it, then click on the settings icon that appears on the top toolbar. And of course, this will open the settings panel for you on your checkout. For me, as an example, as you can see, this is going to be my page. And here, if I go to this list panel, as an example, if I click just on this plus button, or as you can see, you'll be able to add any elements, sections, uh, page and menus, uh, site design, apps, business, media, manager, and marketing and SEO. As you can see, this is content manager. So if we go here to pages example, we'll find here a lot of pages. So for you, you can go and add some pages if you want or delete them for me. I'm just going to click at this bottom option. As you can see, you'll be able to find any layer that you have. But for us, we will have to go and click on settings here at the top uh, kind of left corner. And here, so first let's check if everything is working. We can go and click on preview as an example here. And let's just wait for the preview until it's uh, here. As, you can, as an example, I'm just going to choose this product. I would like to buy this, uh, this product here. Let's just choose this color and click on add to cart. And as you can see now, I can simply go and click on view cart. And here I'll be able to go to checkouts as an example. If you click on checkouts, as you can see, we can accept online orders right now. So click on got it. That means I don't have any checkout now, so I will not be able to edit it. Of course, we can simply go to this left panel again and click on add apps. And we can simply go here and type checkout. And we'll be able to offer, as you can see, fast checkouts for payments and donations, professional e-commerce platforms to sell online. As an example, you'll have here a lot of apps. So let's just choose this, which is provided by Wix. Simply, you can go and add this again to your Wix store. Once you add it, of course, let's just wait for it until it's added. It should not take a lot of time. So as you can see now, if we go to preview, let's check if everything is working. Let's just go to preview again. And let's just click on checkout now. As you can see, it's still the same problem. So it's added, but it's not working now for now. So as you can see, it's not working because I did not add anything else. So I'll have to go and add some products of my websites. Uh, I'll have to go through a lot of steps. So for me, I'm just going to do so as an example. As you can see, I have here a lot of products. So I can go and add them all as an example. So check them all and simply go. And you can even go and click on the select all if you want to. And you'll be able even to add new products if you click here. And as you can see, you'll have here more actions if you want to export, import, or rearrange, or do whatever you want. 
for example just click on export as example uh, and as you can see once the export is complete your file download will do again so for me I'm don't, I don't want to do that yeah I'm just show you if you want to export you will be able to even to import it if you want to and that will be good to go so then you can even set your shipping we don't care about even shipping let's simply go to connect a payment method which is the checkout page so simply click on connects this uh, or checkout or payments which which is the checkout directly and as you can see here you will have two options you will have the option of connecting your paypal you can simply click on connect and as you can see you will have to go and follow this instructions to connect your paypal so simply enter your paypal account email from down below click on connect so you'll be redirected to paypal you'll have to go and log in from there and if you can't find the your credential of course uh, you will have to go on paypal and change your password or anything like that then simply click on connect if you want you can even use this manual payments as you can see allow to you to accept cash a check or other custom form of payments you can simply click on connect you'll be able to add manual payments cash payments offline payments or cash on delivery so add whatever suits you and you you even have as you can see you can add some instructions if you want to add this type of checkout and click on connect as example i'm just going to do cash on delivery like uh, when you re receive order pay that's the only instruction click on connect and as you can see manual payments uh, connected uh, so it's time to upgrade your site as you can see upgrade your sites with the business and e-commerce plan premium to start accepting payments with manual payments if you want to and as you can see all payments plans have a 14 days money back guarantee so if you didn't like it you can simply use this free trial of 14 days and give it back and as i said you can even connect your paypal and now you can simply go to preview and go and check if everything is working click on checkout now as you can see it's still the same problem because i don't have the or i did not upgrade my sites but for you of course you will be normally good to go after you check everything so simply i'll have to go here to manage apps and let's just wait for the page until it loads so simply go to here the Wix stores as an example sorry not here Quick stores example and we said uh, here so of course you can simply open it from here and you will be able to manage payments even from here or quick edits everything from there so that's how you can actually customize your checkouts or even edit this from there and you'll be able to edit your paypal into another paypal or edit your manual payments to whatever you want you can even see more payments option from here as you can see there's faster pay and uh, for other options so you can go and uh, connect whatever suits you of course if you click on connect you'll find all the instructions here you'll have to simply follow them and you'll be good to go so if you reach this point of this video congratulations you've successfully edited and even added your checkout page and wix and 23 of course customizing your checkout page is essential for providing a smooth and branded experience to your customers during the purchasing process thank you for watching this tutorial so make sure to leave down below uh, a like and subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials like this and we hope it was helpful for you so if you have any further questions feel free to explore the wix support resources or join their community for assistance and of course, uh, thanks for watching again, and I'll see you in the next video.